38 yeah. degrees your temperature right now. Hope you're having a great start to your Thanksgiving. I know a lot of you are probably up with us right now, starting to get the cooking going and all that, because this is the only day, maybe Christmas too, where it's acceptable to eat dinner at like one yeah. or two. Oh, yeah. I know we have a lot of friends doing that. Yeah. 20s and 30s right now, 41 up in Everett. I'm curious, uh, actually, uh, message me on Twitter or Facebook. I want to I want to know what the earliest uh, thing you're doing today is. So, like, if you're eating at, like, 11 or something, something ridiculous like that, I want to hear about that. That would be interesting. Up to Bellingham, two and a half miles of visibility, where we're seeing some uh, pretty thick fog. is down towards Chehalis and Centralia, also near JBLM and Lakewood. So in those spots, you're going to be dealing with a lot more of that. Leave some distance between you and the car in front of you and slow down a little bit. Uh, you don't want an accident here on Thanksgiving. Good news is today we're dry. We're going to stay dry all day and sunny. In fact, this afternoon looks fantastic. We get into tomorrow. Here comes the rain, folks. And this is all going to arrive in the overnight period. And it will be starting off uh, fairly light and then pick up by 8 o'clock. So if you're heading out for Black Friday shopping, you're going to be dealing with this. This will also uh, to, uh, translate to snow up in the mountains. So we're going to be dealing with a lot of that by the time we get into the lunch hour. So if you need to travel over the mountains, make sure you do that in the first half of the day. Get ahead of it because otherwise you're going to deal with snow for the second half of the day Friday. Or you could wait on it into Saturday and Sunday. And yes, we will be getting a little bit more snow up in the mountains Saturday and Sunday, but it's just going to be a little bit. I think Friday we could see a decent amount. Uh, Apple Cup, of course, is on Saturday. I'll have that forecast for you coming up in just a bit. Seahawks play on Sunday here at home. And then we're going to dry out on Monday before we bring in some mixed showers on Tuesday. And Tuesday could get a little bit interesting. We'll have more on that as we get a little bit closer. Let's send it on over to Mr. Gerke here with a check on traffic this morning. How are things looking on this holiday? We are off to a fantastic start here. Nice and light here in the lowlands. Drivers getting up in and around the Michigan curve. 